Hey guys, it's Jenny. Welcome back once again to Solid Gold. I make a calendar of goldfish photos and I've done this every year for the past, I want to say like five years or so. Last year I tried something new for the first time. I set up a 40 gallon breeder tank in my kitchen. Had a perfect background, had sand on the bottom, had little like fake plants perfectly arranged. I did it that way last year instead of just using photos that I had taken throughout the year and kind of compiling them into a calendar. It made the whole calendar look really cohesive. like. Each month's picture looked, you know, had a similar look and feel to the last month and so on. This year I have a little bit more space to work with so I don't have to set it up in my kitchen, thankfully. I wanted to kind of show you guys behind the scenes of what it takes to put this calendar together and all the work that goes into it. So here we go. Let's make the 2017 Solid Gold Calendar. The fake rock background does not want to stay at the bottom. It's styrofoam, so of course it wants to float. Nope. I'm getting really frustrated. got the styrofoam background to stay in place. I'm just crossing my fingers that it will continue to stay in place. And as you can see, the water's really cloudy because of the sand that I added, so I'm probably going to leave it alone for like one or two hours and see if it'll settle. If not, I'll probably have to do a water change. So, we'll be back. There has been no settling of the sediment that's making the water cloudy, so I'm going to go ahead and do a water change. So far, the thing that I kind of jerry-rigged to get the background to stay down is working. It's just a couple of Tupperware-type containers kind of wedged in there, and then the suction cups also helping to hold it in place. And after the water change, it's looking much more clear. Since I did a water change on the photography tank, I also did a water change on all of my other tanks because it's water change day anyways and all the water change equipment was out so I just went ahead and did it. This one just got done filling. This is the one that I put all my fish in until the other tanks are drained and filled and then I put them all back in their normal tanks and I drain and fill this one. This one's filling right now and those two are drained and they're waiting to be filled. This is my Helios lens. It's a really old Russian lens that I actually had to get a special adapter for to be able to use it on my new camera. It makes the background bokeh or uh, the background blur look really, really cool. It's almost like a painting. I'll probably use this lens for some pictures and then also my regular camera lens for some pictures as well. I just put my calico butterflies in the photography tank and I'm going to give them a few minutes just to get used to their surroundings because it's quite a bit different than where they came from.
I am just tired. I've been at this literally all day and I'm frustrated because they don't cooperate and I'm kind of just really over this right now. The water is kind of cloudy because I've had so many fish in and out of there and they've been pooping in it and it's just getting cloudy. So I'm gonna do another water change and keep at it. Well, I just finished photographing my last group of fish, which are my two Watanai goldfish, and I am just totally worn out. <laughs> I've been at this for, I don't know, well over 10 hours today. It's now 10.30 p.m., and I am tired and hungry and ready to call it quits. So I'm gonna be done photographing for tonight. I will take inventory of the photos that I got, and hopefully I got at least 12 that are calendar worthy and I can put in the 2017 solid gold calendar. I'm so tired and I think all my fish are just like, what the heck lady? <sighs> I'm delirious, I'm so hungry. So thanks for watching another solid gold video everyone. I hope you enjoyed this behind the scenes look at the making of a solid gold calendar. When the calendars are ready for sale, they will be available on my website, which is solidgoldaquatics.com. I'll see you guys all next time and until then, stay gold.